guys, so I'm back from the grocery store. I was going to go to Aldi and everything probably would have came to around $50, $55. I just needed to get my um, dairy-free creamer at a different store, but I saw fresh thyme and I couldn't help but shopping there. I actually went in there to get my half and half. This is the half and half that I drink that's dairy-free. And um, when I went in there, I noticed that the produce was a really good price. And then they had some deals on some other things. So I just, instead of going to two different places, I stuck at Fresh Time. And I did go over my budget by $18. I spent $68.47 at the store today. And I will put up the prices up on the screen. But really, the reason why... There's probably two, well, three, maybe three different reasons why um, I spent more at the store this week is because I got a more expensive cut of meat and I've got four different kinds of meat this week. Um, I picked up an extra thing of meat because it was on sale and um, of course my dairy free half and half is more expensive and then I picked up some organic coffee because I've been hearing a lot of people say that coffee is one of the most um, highly sprayed and pesticide um, food out there. If, if coffee is a food, coffee is a food group to me, trust me. And I drink a lot of coffee. So um, I'm trying to buy organic now coffee. So that was a little bit more expensive than my normal like Aldi 12 count K cups for five dollars. Actually, it wasn't even that much more expensive. I think it was maybe two dollars more expensive and I got ground. Okay, so all of that being said, I'm gonna flip you around. I'm going to show you what I got and then I will get into what I'm going to meal prep. So this is everything that I got for $68. Sorry if you hear my washing machine in the background. Actually, let me stop it because it's pretty loud. Okay, I stopped the washing machine so it won't be so loud. So I'm just going to jump right on in. I picked up these bag of organic carrots. The um, only reason I picked up organic for these, first of all, you should because they're um, grown in the ground and they do spray um, carrots. <laughs> but anyways, these were only 99 cents a bag and they were pretty cheap. And um, it was a great price for organic um, carrots. I will say that Fresh Time, sometimes their organic prices are better than their regular prices. So I always try to compare. So I picked up a bag of these. These are for snacks. I'm going to put some of this in a recipe this week. Picked up some, some fresh cilantro. Delicious. My fruit of the week are going to be these navel oranges. They were not that expensive and I've been craving citrus. So um, I picked up a bag of those and I also picked up two organic apples. These are um, organic gala apples and they were only 99 cents a pound and all of the other apples were either $1.99 or $2.99 a pound. So I thought that was a great price. So I just picked up two for a little bit of variety this week. I picked up some potatoes two lemons. I actually needed limes this week, but the limes were super expensive. I think they were three for two dollars. Ridiculous. So I think these were only two for a dollar. So I'll just substitute what I was going to use limes for for lemons. No big deal. Picked up two Roma tomatoes. Picked up some flour tortillas for um, shrimp tacos this week. Delicious. These avocados are smaller. Um, they were only 50 cents. That's when I decided that I was just gonna stick with fresh thyme because these, I think at all day this week were either 89 or 99 cents a piece. They have, may have been bigger, but I mean, this is plenty for me since it's only me and it's a perfect size. So for 50 cents, I got one ripe one, one non-ripe one, so I can have two. Jalapeno, some garlic, and some onions out of all of that. Needed some mushrooms. And this is the coffee that I picked up, this organic Peru. It is a medium roast. 
and it's ground coffee. And I have those little, I'll show you, these little reusable K-cups that I can put in my Keurig. So this will take me a long way for the price. It was much better than just 12 pods of organic um, K-cups. So I picked up a 10 ounce bag of this organic coffee, two cartons of chicken broth. I need definitely one for a recipe and I always like to have one on hand. And I mean, they're not as cheap as Aldi, but they're not that expensive, the Fresh Time brand. So I got two of those. I picked up some dairy-free sour cream. This Tofruity uh, brand is very good, actually. So I picked up a carton of sour cream and a carton of cream cheese just to have. I have plans for the sour cream, but this will last if I don't open it. Um, look at the sale by date, December of 2022. I mean, this, you know, I can use this whenever. Um, I picked up a carton of my half and half. This is my tried and true creamer. It is oat milk and coconut milk combined. It is so creamy and so delicious. Um, and I just love it. It's my favorite dairy-free creamer. And then I needed some dairy-free oat milk. Uh, for recipes and such. I picked up a bag of my favorite sunflower crisp salad. The salad is absolutely delicious. It has a sweet onion vinaigrette in it that is so good. So good. So I picked up a bag of that. Then I needed some bacon. This bacon was on sale and um, it's uncured and it would be, since it was on sale, it would have been cheaper than Aldi anyway. So I picked up uh, a thing of bacon. And these drumsticks, I didn't have plans for them, but they were 50 cents off. So they were like $1.99 or something crazy like that. So I picked up a package of those. Those are easy to um, whip up, throw them in the air fryer, cook them up, put them on salads, like take the meat off the bone, put them on a salad. Delicious. So I just always like to have some type of chicken on hand that I can do that with. Then I picked up a package of ground white chicken meat. I think this is about the same price as my Aldi. I think it was $3.99 for this. But the last time I went to Aldi sometime last week, they were out of all meats, all meats. The only thing they had was ground bison. And personally, I've never had bison, but people say it's good. But I just wasn't chancing that. I didn't know if their supply chain was backed up or what was going on. So again, I was at fresh time, they had everything I needed, and the prices were not that bad. Now this is the cut of meat that really kind of put me over. I really don't buy pork roasts or roasts very often. Um, and this is a lot, going to be a lot when I make this, so I'll give part of this meal to my daughter. Could even freeze some of it. But this was the cheapest one that they had for $8.18. Some was over $15, I mean, but they are obviously bigger. So I picked up a pork roast for a recipe this week. Mm -hmm.